Hi and welcome back to In The Lux, or if this is your first time, welcome. My name is Ruby and In The Lux is all about luxury for the babe on a budget. And this is actually the second time that I'm filming this video. Long story cut short, I am not great at technology it turns out. I won't go into it, but basically I somehow managed to turn the audio sound recording on my camera up to five million decibels. So every time I was filming the video and playing it back, if I just even said a word slightly louder, like if I just said and, it would be like Poof! My freaking eardrums were getting shot to sh so I am finally worked it out actually with Sam. Today's video is actually really fun. It's gonna be an Amazon things that I always repurchase on Amazon because I saw one of my favorite ever YouTubers, Naomi Boyer, do this video and talk about the things that she was purchasing on Amazon. And seeing as Amazon has just been our freaking lifesaver, best friend, ride or die, while quarantine is happening, I was like, you know, I better do a freaking video to celebrate Amazon. So today I'll be showing you five of most favorite things that I buy again and again on Amazon and just talking you through what they're about and yeah that's it really let's just let's not dilly dally let's get straight into it so the first thing that I wanted to talk about is kind of random but it's something that I've been obsessed with for like the last six months and it is slim fast shakes it's random it is quite an old school like thing a slim, slim fast shake but what I've been doing with these is I have been having them as like a meal replacement instead of lunch because I hate lunch. Unless it's the weekend and we're going out for like a boozy brunchy lunch where like I can have a glass of wine and you can order from a menu. That kind of lunch I am down for. But the lunch basically Monday to Friday, either when you're at work or like, yeah, when you're at work basically, um, is a bit of a downer because you can't really have like a proper meal where you've cooked it in the kitchen. A pre-packaged sandwich is not my jam. I hate pre-packaged sandwiches. And basically what I end up doing is I will just indulge in absolute shit. Basically I'll end up having like McDonald's or just something really unhealthy. And also in quarantine, if I don't have like a slim fast shake, I'll be like, I'm gonna make a really unhealthy brunch with like French toast and all of this stuff that really is like a weekend meal. So basically I've just been having slim fast shake instead of lunch, Monday to Friday. And I do like the intermittent, intermittent fasting. And then it's like my first meal of the day and it's just really easy on your stomach, you know. I just find it as a really nice like first meal of the day. It keeps me really full. So I'll start with the slim fast shake at like 11 and then I'll have like a snack at three-ish where I'll have like some Warburton's Thins or maybe like some one of those fiber bars or something like that and then I'll have like a massive dinner and that's kind of been my jam for like Monday to Friday on quarantine obviously like on the weekend I just eat my whole like we just finished pretty much a whole cake to ourselves that's enough about why I have it I'll just tell you a bit about why I buy it on Amazon so on Amazon it's cheaper than it is in Sainsbury's so on Amazon it's like 4 95 and in Sainsbury's or Boots it's like seven quid um, so it's cheaper and also they have a lot more flavors on Amazon. So they've got like strawberry, um, chocolate, they've got caramel, they've got mocha, like a latte, mocha thingy, banana, vanilla, tons of flavors. So really recommend those if you are into things like that, like shakes. So another thing that I always, always repurchase on Amazon is the Rimmel London 60 Second Shine Nail Polishes. And the reason why I buy these on Amazon is because, again, they're a lot cheaper. Um, so in like boots, they're about like 350, 395. But on Amazon, they're like one pound 75. They're super cheap. And I am not really that adventurous when it comes to nail polish shades. I pretty much just wear these two shades so I can rebuy them all the time. So the shade I'm wearing right now is called Caramel Cupcake. And it's just a really nice nude, gonna show is it gonna show great yeah so here is the um, shade I love like a short straight nail and I just wear basically this one or the this one which is called lose your lingerie and I'm pretty sure I'm gonna wear one of these two shades for my wedding because I just think they're really cute. Which one would you wear? Obviously like the lighter one is a bit more modern bride. I feel like this says modern bride, this says traditional bride. Which bride 
should I be? So that's the light pink one or the like nudie one. Love to know your thoughts on that. And the great thing again about this um, nail varnish is that it literally dries in 60 seconds. They do not joke. It's super quick to dry, especially if you just do one coat, but I usually do two. Um, and it is maybe like a little longer than 60 seconds, but it's, it's a pretty quick process and nobody has time like to be sitting around waiting for nails to dry for like seven hours. Like we, we need to keep it moving. Next up, another, I have a few like beauty products because you know, we just love beauty. The next thing that I always buy on Amazon is rose hip oil and I always talk about rose hip oil like on my insta stories and instagram but I love rose hip oil I love using it to um prime my face with makeup so um I use a mixture of rose hip oil and dove lotion and it's just a really nice silky smooth base for makeup rose hip oil is just in general a very good skincare product because it literally has one ingredient um, 100% pure organic rosehip oil, cold, pressed, and unrefined. And you can use this on your skin, you can use it on your hair, your nails. Um, it's actually proven, so it says it's rich in omega-3, nine fatty acids, proven to protect and repair damaged skin, fine lines and wrinkles. And I've got so many people hooked on it. My mom is obsessed. My best friend Kim uses it every day. Um, also, if you do dermaplaning, no, I always say dermaplaning, it's derma rolling. You know when you do that thing where you like roll out the, uh, and you do those like really micro needle, when you do that, that skincare regimen thing. Rosehip oil is actually recommended to put on your skin afterwards because it's just so gentle. So we love rosehip oil from Amazon and I've bought it like a few times now and it's really cheap on there. It's like 9 99 for a bottle and a bottle lasts you like three and a half, four months with like heavy usage. So it's pretty good. Another thing that I always buy on Amazon, if you haven't heard about this mascara, then you probably like have just been born because this is literally like the best mascara. Um, so it's called the Lash, Lash, I can never say it, Lash Sensational. And on Amazon, again, it's way cheaper than in Boots. So on Amazon, I can get it for like five quid-ish and in Boots, it's like seven. It's just generally in a, re a really good mascara. The reason why it's so good is it's got like a fat, so it's curved and then it's got like a chunkier bit at the top and then a skinnier bit at the bottom. And it's great because the, the fat bit at the top is great for your top lashes and then the bottom bit it's great for your bottom lashes and that probably doesn't make any sense but you can kind of see what I mean like so if I just hold it up here the bottom's like fatter £5.95 I think ish £5 ish great mascara like literally I've tried other mascaras after using this one and nothing really ever compares I mean I'm sure like a Dior mascara would really be great but um I don't want to spend like £20 on a mascara I want to spend like £5 final thing that I get from Amazon this is my favorite okay maybe not but I love it. So, Coffee Mate Coffee Creamer in the French vanilla flavor. In the UK, I feel like Coffee Creamer is not a big enough deal. Like, it needs to be a big deal. Basically, when I went to Vegas, it was like the first time that I'd tried like so many American things. And I bought, for some random reason, like this massive container of this French vanilla creamer and if you're an American right now you're probably like is this girl actually talking about coffee creamer in the UK this is not a thing so when you go to someone's house for coffee they do not offer you coffee creamer they'll give you like milk or have it black this will change up the coffee game now this is not a healthy choice I'll mostly have a black coffee but if you just want like a yummy morning cup of coffee and you just want to be like cozy and you're like doing your makeup and stuff make yourself like a hot black coffee and add like one to two of these coffee creamers and the other really good thing is that they come in individual servings you can keep them for for a while and they won't go off like milk would it's so good and they have loads of other flavors i've never tried any other flavor i just like the french vanilla they've got also got um cafe mocha Hazelnut, Irish cream, vanilla, caramel. But I think I'm gonna try one of them. I might try like the hazelnut. If anyone's tried that, tell me if it's any good. Basically, yeah, that's everything that I always repurchase from Amazon. I'm gonna do another video soon, which is more of like a one-off purchases from Amazon that I love. Whereas this is things that I buy all the time on Amazon. But yeah, I'm just loving this Amazon vibe going online at the moment. 
Um, but yeah, give this video a thumbs up if you want to see that next video um, with the things that I buy. Like, I think I'll just call it something like must-haves because they, you need them in your life right now. Please like and subscribe and I will see you in my next video.